This video is brought to you by Squarespace. From now until October 9th, you can get 10% off your film developing and scanning orders at my go-to film lab, Speedy ePhoto. Check the info in the description for all the details. I had the fucking lens cap on. So fun, man. I just dropped the lens cap off of a fucking cliff. Oh my fuck. When the sun's going down, no stars in the sky. I'm a head down the road, across county line, where the roll of the smoke, they pour beer and wine, and hearts break on the jukebox, where the neon stars shine. Well, 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 it's good to be back. Although it's a super late start to the season, the first backpacking trip of the year is underway. And it's the first backpacking trip I've ever done with company. <laughs> super excited to have a hiking buddy with me on this one. Those solo nights up at the Alpine Lakes can get a little bit unnerving. So it's great that Alicia's here and it's her first ever backpacking trip. We're starting her off with a nice little 20 miler. It's gonna be super fun. I've been wanting to do this hike for a long time. Got the Mamiya 7 on its first backpacking trip as well. Very nice not having the weight of the Pentax on my back, I'll tell you that much. But beautiful day, sunny skies, great temps. It's gonna be an excellent first backpacking trip of the year. Let's do it. All right, mile seven or so. We are just about at the big elevation gain. We've been looking forward to it the whole hike and it's right up ahead, so we're super excited. Apparently there's a waterfall not too far ahead too, so that'll be a nice little motivation boost uh, before we begin the final trek of death. Chugging along. How we doing? Man, I'm hung out to dry. Just to do in our time. Where the neon stars shine. I like hiking in the thick forest down at the valley floor. A lot of greenery, a lot of shade, which is nice. But my favorite part of any hike is when you get up high enough and the views start to open up and it looks like this. Oh yeah, that is tough to beat right there. Expanding views in every direction big rolling rock hills and mountains. It don't get better. Well, 
of Chattanooga, boy. First vantage point of Spectacle Lake. Absolutely beautiful. This is probably the best vantage point in the whole area. So I'm gonna load up a roll of Porta Potty 400 to celebrate. I'm gonna go find a camp spot after this. How happy I did feel. The whole time you're just going up that fucking hill just wanting to die. You just want to collapse and just give up. And then you get right here to this moment and then you're like, that's why I did it. Don't you agree, Alicia? Or are you not quite there yet? I'm getting there. Working <laughs> for that dog, but it never adds up at all. Coming around the river banker, the old train was so sane. The very next thing you hear from me, I've been tied to a boy. I should wind the camera. Reckon I don't know where I'll be But if it wasn't for that old sheriff I'd be back in Tennessee Playing cards and crap games Not looking for the score And if I ever get back home again I'll never roam no There's a lovely little village of backpackers down here. Very cool. Buy yourself a postcard. That's see cool. the lights of town. Find yourself a country girl. Keep quiet. A valley of like-minded people. My kind of place. <laughs> Ignition sequence activated. This me and my stove. What more do I need? Bolts of lightning pouring rain. You good? Crescent moon has taken it so far away to lay down. One more lazy dream. I can't sleep They used to cook Now you and me We was thicker than love But the sky grew dark And got inside of me I still hear the words you told me Baby gonna be so lonely but it isn't true. I was just as long. It is getting dark outside, and if you know me, you know I like trying to find a couple long exposures. Got to roll a Porter 800. That extra stop can make a big difference. Someday soon, I'm gonna go Back behind the clouds to see the big light show All right, I'm getting really silly now. This flash has unlocked a whole new realm of possibilities. So what I'm hoping for is a lot of star trails. I'm gonna shoot this at F11. It's gonna be a six minute exposure after reciprocity. So I'm hoping for a decent amount of star trails on that six minute exposure. Nothing crazy, but just a little bit of star trail, and hopefully the tree will be illuminated enough by the flash to kind of get like the tree decently exposed, and then star trails behind it. Experimental time. I don't, I don't really know if it's gonna work, but there's only one way to find out. I thought that I would feel brand new, but troubles on the way. And I know that there's a solitary life that's filled. Sometimes 
Good morning, everybody. 5.30, sun's about to rise here in the next 30 minutes. I hiked back on top of the ridge that I shot a couple pictures at yesterday when we were coming into Spectacle Lake, and I'm glad that I decided to do this. Every time I've tried to get up for sunrise up in the mountains, I just wake up in my sleeping bag. I convinced myself not to do it, but today we're up here and it is unbelievably beautiful. I can't pretend much too late to try. I had the fucking lens cap on. These fucking rangefinders, man. I just dropped the lens cap off of a fucking cliff. Oh my god. Dude. <laughs> Alright, well, multi exposure this one and then bang out one more. But that first one, is it gonna be a nice black screen? Alright, frame number two. Here we go. I have a pretty bad feeling that shooting Velvia is definitely not the move. Just because the light is not evening, evening out the way that I would like it to. But I've always been a bit of an idiot, so I think I'm going to do it anyway. I'm not even looking for this to work out in my favor. I'm just looking to get something usable. Just as lonely with you. So I guess I always will be. So yeah, I did drop my lens cap right off the edge of that. So I am gonna side quest this and see if I can find it. Oh shit. I give my chances. Oh my fuck. God. I'd say my chances are extremely slim. God, it's gotta be right here though, somewhere. So fun, man. Safe to say, side quest failed. Adhesive strips at the end of the row. Little pit stop on the way back to camp. Really nice vantage point of the cove that Alicia and I posted up at the end of. The only other roll that I brought with me was Porter 400, so I'm gonna load that in. This mummy is gonna get beat up if I keep bringing it on these trips, which of course I will. All right, campsite is packed up. We're about to head out. I'm gonna grab an absolutely poser fly fishing uh, self-portrait before I go. I know nothing about fly fishing. I probably look like an absolute idiot, but I don't know, I think it'll be a cool photo. and. A nice little memory for the beginning of my obviously very successful fly fishing career. To be kind. The nice thing about losing my lens cap is that I don't have to worry about shooting with my lens cap on again. You can't make that mistake if you don't have a fucking lens cap. The heart is not in. Wildflowers are absolutely beautiful on this part of the trail. Didn't get a good photo of them on the hike up, so trying to take advantage right now. Mud on your boots tell the story of where you've been. Travel beat up, born in with settled soul. Trust your God, you have her. I have never in my life been more excited to see my car. My feet have never been in this much pain. Spectacle Lake 2023, what an experience. I am on the brink of complete and utter destruction. 
And this is the only thing that could potentially save me from that. Burger, beer. Let's pray it revives me. Overall, I still give it a 10 out of 10. Spectacle Lake, good on you. Cheers. Squarespace is the best in the business when it comes to building a new website. Whether you're a photographer, artist, musician, or starting a new business, Squarespace has all the tools you need to get a professional website up and running. I recently hosted an entire online photography gallery that featured 100 photographers from around the world on my personal website, and that's all thanks to Squarespace. The website building interface is extremely intuitive and absolutely zero coding is necessary. They have a ton of fantastic templates to choose from, and from there you can begin to further customize the look and feel of your site to make it unique to you. On top of that, they have great e-commerce tools that let you keep track of orders, inventory, customers, offer memberships, and more. And with fantastic customer service, you're always in the clear if you ever need help along the way. If you'd like to receive 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain, head over to squarespace.com bray or use code bray at checkout to do so.